beloved. Fill the cup that clears today of past regrets and future fears. Tomorrow, tomorrow I may be myself with yesterday's seven thousand years. Broken, you tell him captains don't cry, especially if he wants to hold up a championship trophy. Get up, Whip. Get him out of there. No, I'm fine. Timmy, come here now. All right, I want five laps from everybody before you go today. Now hit it. Now, can this team count on you two not killing each other? Huh? Good, because I made a change in the championship lineup. And I want you two playing up front as co-captains. Now give me 10 laps right now. Go. What's your name? Ruchi. I'm a co captain. Ruchi? What a Jew, Jim. How do you know that the captain is that? Me, do know. Can you tell me this story once? I know, just please. Just one more time. 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 Just one more در اون موقع به غیر از مادرش به تنها کسی که میتونست تکیه کنه دوستش دریا بود Stars, they're your friends. Is that why you understand them? I'm sorry about your father, Omar. I miss him. I'll never leave you, Omar. It is a gift from God. How else would a little boy know such things? You could take the boy. He could work for you. We'll see, we'll see. God bless you. Omar, come and meet Professor Imam Muwafak. But he's a small boy. What can a boy this small possibly know? Show him, Omar. You are wasting my time, woman. What?
You'll do some chores for me. But I'll take you as a student. I'll pay him also, so you'll have enough to eat. You are most kind, sir. We'll start tomorrow. Derive the root of these equations and solve the problem. Now, looking at Euclid's fifth postulate. Omar, come with me. There are three things a boy must learn to become a man. Shoot straight, ride well, and never tell a lie. Hassan, Omar, his father is a great warrior. He teach you things not written in books. Go. حسن و عمر رفته رفته دوستایی سمیمی خیلی خوبی شدن و پدر حسن عمر را مثل پسر خودش میدونست با دریا این دوستی قوی تر شد که هر سه دوستان سمیمی خیلی خوب بودن در یاد جای مخصوصی در قلب آمار داشت با گذر زمان دوستی در میون چشم مردم طور دیگه ای جلوه دار هی، how much for this beautiful slave Until the passing of the new moon. 
No more than two, at most. You've got many friends tonight. Did they ever speak of me? Then it. The brightest star in the universe. Every time I look at it, I think of you. I am afraid, Omar. Was it the man at the market? I don't know. He will never bother you. I just... Close your eyes. My little star. Happy hunting. I divorced old barren reason from my bed and took the daughter of vine to spout. You like him? I know you do. I do like him. He's magnificent. I'll trade you. Give me Daria for the horse. That is not mine to give. All right. <coughs> we'll fight for her. Boy. What are you doing? My oh. father doesn't approve of her. <coughs> He thinks she's beneath us. I think he's more concerned about your future at court. I, on the other hand, have no such aspirations, so... What if I don't want to be a puppet to the Sultan? He's already mapped out your destiny. <laughs> <laughs> سن و عمر در اون موقع نمیدونستن که دوستشون با یه دختر برده چقدر میتونه رو زندگیشون اثر بذاره. That's gonna be you one day. There was nothing I could do. What's wrong, Mother? They took Daria. 
sold her to a merchant two days after you left. Sold Daria? They were only here for a few days. She has been gone almost three moons now. Omar, she was our neighbor's slave. They had every right to sell her. Omar, wait, listen to me. You have no money. Imam Muwafak is letting you study. Do not ruin your future. She is my future. We will find her. This should be enough. We'll buy her and set her free. You will go south and west and I will go north and east. God be with you. Inshallah. Here you gotta hear Em's new single. با نخوردنت نمیتونه اونو از مرگ نجات بده مادر جان ما باید برای نادر دعا کنیم چرا اگه بچهش بمیره من دلم برای شهین کباب میشه قلبش هنوز در ایرانه ولی منصور منصور همش در فکر آینده بچه هاست کامران جایی نمیره اند از فاینو Are you so ashamed of being Persian? We belong here now in America, nobody cares where you come from. It's where you're going that counts. And where is that? I love Iran, but the Iran we grew up in is history. I want my kids to have opportunities. I won't let Kamran be confused with the delusion of a country that may or may not accept him one day. And have you accepted what he wants? He was known to be a genius, so it had to be right. Hey, I was listening to that. Not anymore, you're not. All right, let's see who's next now. Um, Bobby, are you ready? Enjoy your spring break, everybody, but remember your Texas history assignment, how we became a republic from 1836 to 1845, and there will be a quiz when you get back. Cameron, what is this? Cubic equations. It's nothing, Miss Taylor. I was just doodling. Gotta run. Wait, Cameron. I've got something I want you to give to Nada. The Great Omar. It's the poster of the Rubaiyat of Omar Khayyam. I know your brother has some interest in him. Anyway. The library was throwing it out, and I took it, thinking that Nader might enjoy it. Thank you, Miss Taylor. Goodbye. I have a surprise for you from Miss Taylor. She found it in the library trash. Awesome. 
great. Um. This exquisitely bound edition of the Rubaiyat of Ramat Chaim was lost when I went down with the Titanic in 1912. The great Omar, as it is affectionately known, is bounded by the famous craft bookbinding firm of Sangorsky and Sutcliffe. Wow. In London, this English guy made it. I know how many books we've been able to make sure of. خیلی مهمه که بدون هنوزم که هنوز ما فکر عمر خیام هست. Did Omar and Hassan find Daria? هم حسن هم عمر گشتن و گشتن ولی پیداش نکردن. اما عشق دریا هیچ وقت از دلشون بیرون نره. برای حسن عشق دیگه مهم نبود. تنها چیزی که براش مونده بود ایمانش به خدا و مذهبش بود. It was God's will. Imperator Pars, به دست مسلمانان ترک به نام سلجوقیان افتاد. و ملک شاه رهبر جدید سلجوقیان شد. Don't follow me. Want to be alone. His father has been killed. Let him mourn. ریشه قدرت سلجوقیان از دین اسلام گرفته شده بود. این یه زنگ خطری بود برای وابستگان روم شرقی که بیان تو منطقه و دین مسیح پایگذاری کنن. Daria, Daria, my beloved, fill the cup that clears today of past regrets. Daria, Who are you? Daria. Wait. How dare you turn your back to me? Do you know who I am? Answer me at once. You are... Probably. As important as that one star. Like me, your destiny lies there. And one day, you too shall fade away. My beloved, fill the cup that clears today of past regrets. Asked for me? The book of life. What have we learned? For every year we've been on this earth, we've turned one page in the book of life. How many pages have you read? Twenty-five. I'm on page 57. I've been called to court as the Grand Vizier to the new Seljuk Sultan. Omar Khayyam. I need you to replace me. Turn the pages carefully.
Al-Biruni discovered mathematical techniques to measure the beginning of the seasons exactly. Well, not only that, he recorded the sun, its movements, and the eclipse. This he did through the use of an astronomical instrument, device, known as the astrolabe. Ahmed, do the honors, will you? As you can see, the back of the astrolabe is divided into quadrants with astronomical trigonometrical tables used to find the position of the stars, moon and planets in relation to the fixed stars. In Islamic timekeeping, night and day are each divided into 12 equal parts. Thus, only at the equator are night and day of the same length. Do you follow? Salam Shainju. Salam Kurushu. Delam Barut Khili Tang Shude. Madam Hamidu. No, there's a tutor. Frankish Khili Paride. Madam Khili Delva Passer. Java Boss, my Shukunishi. By the back, I don't be more a son. Fardo Bot Tamos Migida. Has it been that long? Only two pages. May I? It's only poetry. Many scholarly men are considered heretics. Sultan wants to see you again. He likes you.
the Byzantine commander has requested more reinforcements from the Pope. We caught one of their spies monitoring your troop movements. Your Excellency, may I present Omar Khayyam, the mathematician and astronomer. You? The one in the desert that night? I understand you've been teaching our young minds throughout the Empire. It has been my privilege, Your Excellency. What do you desire most? Nothing but to live in the shadow of your greatness and to further my studies. I, uh, I didn't understand the things you told me that night. About the stars. I want you to be my celestial navigator. We will build you an observatory to study the stars. You are most gracious and kind. Study the skies tonight. In a few days, I will face the Byzantines. And I want to know if the stars favor me in battle. But first, your old master, Imam Muafak, will announce your appointment to court. I cannot read the stars like you want. Astronomy is not astrology. Listen to me, Omar, and listen to me carefully. Our work is difficult, and our responsibilities to the people are vast. Malik is young. It is my duty to guide him in his decisions, and you will help me. He believes in you. And if he thinks you read it in the stars, then by God, let him think it. I will not lie. I'm not asking you to lie. I'm telling you, we must be careful for Malik. Understand, Omar? I'll do whatever is necessary to protect him and to keep him strong in the eyes of his people. I read your treatise on government. A prince is only as strong as his advisors. But if the advice he receives distorts the truth, doesn't that make him weaker? کم کم معلوم شد که حسن و عمر می‌خواستن راه جداگونه خودشون رو ادامه بدن. And you would find you here. I heard you were leaving. Hassan, I have great news. Where have you been? Cleansing my soul, seeking the truth. You are not a religious man, Omar. You are a man of science. You wouldn't understand. Religious truth is not necessarily the real truth. Most people don't even practice the rituals of their own faith. Absolute belief in God is the only real truth. If faith was equally balanced with reason, don't you think more people would question the depth of their convictions? You ask too many questions. Confuse the people with your heresy. Heresy? Reason above faith is heresy. One must accept absolute authority in matters of religious faith. And who has absolute authority on matters of religious faith? I believe in God. You and I just believe differently. You cannot believe in God on man's terms. God doesn't care how you believe in him just as long as you believe in yourself first. Islam will be destroyed under Malik Shah. Destroyed? Persia has prospered under the Seljuks. 
Look at all the learning centers that have been built. You are being used to further the Sultan's power. Where is all this coming from, Hassan? The search for knowledge is a sacred duty imposed upon every Muslim. Those are the Prophet's words. I pray that our paths never cross again. If they do, I would have to kill you. The most excellent jihad is that of the conquest of self. Goodbye, tentmaker's son. Your Excellency, may I present Omar Hayam to your esteemed court? What have you to say, Omar? Words of wisdom for the souls going into battle against the Byzantines. I'm sure he has something to say. Make the most of what time we yet may spend before we too into dust descend. Dust to dust, under dust to lie, without song, without wine, without end. Though you may have lain with a mistress all your life, tasted the sweets of the world all your life, still the end of the affair will be your departure. It was a dream that you dreamed all your life. Finally, a man who speaks the truth. Here is to Omar Khayyam. I've sent orders to build the observatory for you. If Your Excellency allows, I've found the perfect place without the need to build one for now. Where? An ancient ruin outside Isfahan. I would like to start right away. Fine. You will have it for your studies. Tell me, Omar, how can your mind see what we can't even read? The more I learn, <laughs> the more I realize what I do not know. <laughs> your Excellency. According to my calculations, we are losing one day in every 3,440 years. But I have devised a calendar in appreciation of your greatness that will measure time more accurately. Specifically one that will measure the rotation of the Earth around the Sun down to the 11th decimal point. 
calendar. Yes, Your Excellency. As you can see, the date of the calendar for our new year shall be shifted from the point of the sun's passage through the middle point of Pisces to the first point of Aries. If this calendar proves to be correct, it shall improve all matters relating to your kingdom from revenue collections to the time of the day when we pray. Is that true? So, uh, <laughs> are we praying at the wrong time, Omar? Uh, my calculations will correct the Gregorian calendar <laughs> by having a standard deviation of one day in every 3,770 years. It will carry your Seljuk surname. Ah. The Jalali calendar. That's good. I, I like that. I like that. So when does our year begin? Uh, no, Rus. The first day of spring. It will correspond with the exact moment when the uh, vernal equinox takes place. Good, great. So let's go celebrate my new calendar. I still have work to do, Your Excellency. Uh, the calculations have to be tested for proper accuracy. Ah, that can wait. But my hunger and my thirst cannot. There is a great feast underway. And uh, Malik Shah is asking for you. Come inside. I am content to stay with the stars. I won't find her there. I always do. Omar, try to forget her. Surprise for you. You want her, she's yours. True, what they say about you and the slave girl. Daria? Daria. Finally, we have a name. Daria. The Byzantines are trying to press through our western provinces. Find out the best time for me to attack. قلب دو عاشق هیچ وقت نمیتونه از هم جدا باشه برای همین عشق دریا دوباره راه خودش رو به قلب عمر پیدا کرد
of your great observatory has spread all over the Empire. That's why I came to Isfahan to try to find you. Let's go. Listen to me carefully, Omar. If I do not return now, they will search for me. I am the property of someone. I will find Malik and he will understand. I will spend my entire life in his service if necessary. I will buy freedom. You are my am. Go and come back swiftly. I will be waiting. Daria, the brightest star in my universe. You have no idea how many times I see your face in those stars. Found Daria. So? Oh, Your Excellency. If I am to have her, I must buy her. And the money you gave me, I placed into my research. <laughs> Omar, we shall fill your pockets full of silver and gold so that you can go and buy your precious Daria. You need to rest.
dress her in the finest silks. What happened? Where's Omar? He's back at the observatory. The girl? She was sold to a foreign merchant. We couldn't find her. Get the men ready. We're going back to the palace. ملک شا آماده دفاع خود از حمله ارتش مسیحان می شد یه تعدید دیگر از درون که به اسلام وابسته بود میخواست ملک شا را از حکومت در کنار کنید در همین زمان با گم شدن دریا عشق و آرزوهای عمر از دست رفت I thought you were going to kill me if you saw me again. There are too many people trying to do that already, it seems. Quick, there are more coming. Put this on. Take my horse, ride to Alamut. I will find you. چرا شاهین دادم براش خیلی میسوزه منصور خیلی سرسخته حالا فقط کاران حافظ میراسی ماست شاهین اینو فراموش نکرده پدرت نباید ناراحت بشه اگه ناراحت بشه روحیه به طور کلی از دست میده فردا دوباره باید باهاشون تماس بگیریم باشه
love this song. Do you think I look like him? Kind of. If I fixed my hair back, maybe I could look exactly like him. But you couldn't even tell the difference. He looks... What are you getting at? I want to know the end of the story. You're crazy. Dad would kill you. You wouldn't even make it through check-in. I've got a plan. The plan was quite simple, actually. I downloaded the standard unaccompanied minor form from the airline's website. Unless I forged my mom's signature on the release, typed in her credit card to buy an e-ticket online, and then drove me to the airport. She called ahead to have a chauffeur do a meet and greet at Customs in London. What on earth have you found? How did you get in here? How did you get in here? The front gate was open and I knocked, but no one answered. Better get you in before you freeze. That's it. Come on, Millie. Come on. Alfred, we have a visitor. You get another cup of tea. Very good, madam. No, Alfred, on second thought, do you like hot chocolate? Um, yes, please. Oh, let's give him a hot chocolate. Thank you. And bring another plate. Yes, madam. Millie, come. these yours? Many of them have been in our family for generations. Some of them were even handcrafted by my grandfather. So he did make the book? Yes, he did. Look, do you see this? Oh. He even painted this Persian ode. Can I see it? The book sank with the Titanic. In 1912. But didn't he make a copy? Mm hmm. There is another in the Museum für Kunsthandwerker in Frankfurt, but he did make 550 working copies. 
You must have messed up a lot. <laughs> he wanted to get every detail right. So, can I see one? Oh, thank you, Alfred. That will do. Thank you, Mother. Your accent sounds American. Are you visiting England with your parents? Not exactly. I just came to see the book. Why all this way to see the book? Because my brother said it's important that our grandfather know that people still remember Omar Khayyam. That was hot. And why is Omar Khayyam so important to you? My brother Nader was the keeper. He started telling me the story of Omar, but he didn't finish. I have to go to Iran to hear the rest of the story from my grandfather. He's very old. He's even older than you are. <laughs> <laughs> Did your brother travel here to England with you? No, ma'am. He died. Am I to believe that you traveled here alone? My sister helped me go through check-in in Houston, Texas. Wouldn't your parents be worried about you? But what if my grandfather dies like Nader did? Then the story would be lost. Stand up. Hold up your hands. That hand? This hand. You have to wear the gloves, because otherwise the oil from your hands will damage the handmade paper after a while. Come and sit here on the floor. The Rubaiyat of Ramal Khayyam. Hmm. The Rubaiyat of Omar Khayyam of Nishapur. What does Rubaiyat mean? Rubai is an ancient Arabic word for the number four. However, for the 11th century Persian poets, a Rubai is four lines of poetry. But I don't really understand poetry. Poetry is only words that make you feel something special. Inside. Omar's poetry expressed a very deep belief. One day your life will end. And all that will remain are the moments when you've lived your life to the fullest. And if you're lucky, those moments live on in the lives of the people you have touched. My grandfather used to read these poems to me. The moving finger writes, and having writ, moves on. Nor all thy piety nor wit shall lure it back to cancel half a line. Nor all thy tears wash out a word of it. Here with a loaf of bread beneath the bough, a flask of wine, a book of verse, and thou, beside me singing in the wilderness. And now, wilderness is paradise.
Come run. You don't know me, but before I begin, I want to tell you something important. Your son is safe. Yes, he's safe. He's here, in England. He came to my house. He wanted to see a book. Oh, thank you. No, no, don't thank me. No, he is safe, I promise you. It's very cold here. It's something hot to drink. He's fallen asleep. I'll give you my number. How are the CAD drawings coming along for the Alaskan project? Still on schedule? Yes, sir. It will be done on time. You have my word. You are drilling a dry hole here, partner? Go on home. You need to be with your family. I'll be all right. Listen to me, Mansoor. This is a $6 billion project. I want my chief engineer to think straight. You got to take time and heal. I'm okay. I'm okay. شاید جو نگران نباش. بیزا انگلیس رو دارم. آدرس تلفن خانمو بده. I'm sorry my Farsi isn't very good. <laughs> it's all right, my dear. If it is easier to speak in English. Mom told me it was my responsibility to remember what you taught Nader. I already know some of the story. <laughs> it is important that you remember it here. Life will offer you too many things to be remembered here. What touches the heart is never forgotten. I'll remember that, Grandfather. Oh, a friend of mine let me borrow this to show you. You got to put these on to protect the paper. Why did Hassan save his life? I thought he didn't like him anymore. 
Hassan and his followers had attacked and captured the great castle of Alamut in the mountains outside of Ray. Omar Khayyam, Hassan sent me. Follow me. Hassan became a powerful leader of people within the religion who opposed Malik Shah's brand of Islam. Hassan's followers could not match the Sultan's army, but they could strike fear quickly throughout the empire. Does it surprise you that I have so many followers? They do whatever I ask of them. Go and jump off the wall in the name of God. Surely a man who can ask him to jump can ask him not to jump. Stop! You are weak. I have enough men to do God's will. God's will? In your world, knowledge leads you to power. In mine, faith is power. I could use a great mind like yours. I want nothing to do with any of this. Whatever you want, just ask for it. Together we can make a difference. What difference? Hassan ordered assassinations of many of Malik's men <laughs> to undermine his authority. Clear the room at once. No one is allowed in here unless I say so. Your Excellency, I must have a word with you. These banquets are invitations to murder. Don't you speak to me that way. You are responsible for my safety! Being a sultan is more than throwing lavish parties and being a good hunter. You must respect the religious authority vested in you. <laughs> the, the ulema have what they want. The treasury contributes generously to the mosques. Do not be foolish. Your Excellency, your enemies are not waiting for you to fail. Let them make their move. They'll kill you. I did not ask for your advice, old man. with me. Hassan Malikshe trusts you. You can get close to him. No. The people have suffered and been misled. Malik's time is over. I will not do this. Oh, 
I think you will. Daria for Malik Shah. How did you find her? My father was actually smarter than both of us. He had her bought and taken away, afraid of her power over us. So, Master Omar, how will you solve this problem? You will never get what you want from me this way. His life for Daria. Surely your love for Daria is more than that of Malikshah. I will not betray a friend. You're free to go. Lead him out of the castle. You should have known he would never betray anyone. It is not his character. Why him? Why was it not me whom you loved? Hassan. Thank you for letting him go. When he is led out to the mountains, they will burn his eyes and kill him. Dare you! Find Imam! Master Omar! Where is Malikshah? In battle. Ready six men for travel. Malikshah's men finally met their enemy face to face. They were a group of Christians who formed a small military calling themselves Crusaders. By joining forces with the Byzantine army on their way to capture Jerusalem, the first crusaders defeated the Seljuks and swept 
across what is today called the country of Turkey. As soldiers of Christ, the Crusaders were so fierce that they killed all Muslims and Jews in the holy city before establishing the Latin Kingdom of Jerusalem. the way people fought for their land in the name of faith. Malik Shah and his importance soon faded away as his fragile empire broke apart. What happened to Hassan? He became known as the old man of the mountains. He ruled from the shadows along with his silent killers who were known as Hashishin. That's where the term assassin came from. And Omar? Omar wrote his views on life and the universe in a collection of timeless poetry which was translated into every major language. Great master of learning. This boy has no family. We have hidden him from our masters. But as he gets older, it's more difficult. If he's found, he will be sold as a slave. Perhaps you could teach him. What's your name? Deneb. It is our legacy. You mean? That's right. It was all Mars. Darius. And now it's yours. 
It belongs to you and your future children and their children. <laughs> Remember, it wasn't Omar's poetry that made him important. It was the poetry of his life. <laughs>